For 20 million years, kangaroos have thrived in one of the harshest climates on Earth. They do this on limited grass, limited water, produce little or no methane, and don't use antibiotics. Kangaroos require about 5 kilos of grass to put on 1 kilo of red meat, while in the same paddock, sheep and cattle need about 20 kilos of grass just to do the same thing. So Proagni asked, what if sheep and cattle could mimic kangaroos? The problem is, food needs to be affordable, abundant, and have a smaller environmental footprint. So how can farmers reduce greenhouse gas emissions from ruminants, do it with limited resources, remove the use of antibiotics as growth promoters, and not blow the economics of farming out of the water? Proagni solutions have two distinct parts. First is protect which is a patented range of feed supplements. Our prebiotic significantly improves animal health, production efficiency, and eliminates the need for in-feed antibiotics and lowers farming's contribution to the global problem of antimicrobial resistance. It's disruptive technology that doesn't require behavioral change on farm. Farmers love it because it's a simple switch out. It has the same inclusion rate delivered the same way they've always done and can be used in small and large feedlots around the world. Our commercial trials and growth in sales show in-feed antibiotics can be removed from the feeding system and deliver a more profitable outcome for farmers. The Protect range is currently in market, has fed over a million animals and removed a thousand kilos of in-feed antibiotics that would have otherwise been included in animals' daily diets. Second is our patent-pending probiotics. These directly influence microbial populations in the rumen. And we have developed shelf-stable anaerobic probiotics. To explain... The market for probiotics has largely used aerobic bacteria. They're the ones that like oxygen. But over 95% of the bacteria present in the rumen are anaerobic and rapidly die in the presence of oxygen. They are difficult to culture and shelf stabilize, so their use in in-feed additives is extremely limited. But the important species of bacteria for manipulating the rumen function to improve output decrease emissions, and reduce the need for in-feed antibiotics are anaerobic. And we have taken strict obligate anaerobes, cultivated them commercially, removed the requirement for cold chain storage, extended their shelf life, and reduced the overall volume needed to get results. Using these bacteria, we can take methane produced by the animal and turn it into a food source for the animal. They can significantly decrease emissions, improve production efficiency, and maintain animal health. And if we do our job right, we can provide a step change to the way we feed animals around the world that produces abundant, affordable food with a smaller environmental footprint. And we are only just getting started.